Rally legend Sebastien Loeb suffered three punctures on stage four, the marathon stage. The Frenchman's pace had been good before dropping time late on the stage, limping in more than 12 minutes back from stage winner Nasser al Antia. We had to change the wheel three times and on the last puncture we had to put a tyre back on that was already punctured. Even a warm reception at the car's bivouac in Tacna didn't lift the morale of Loeb's co-driver Daniel Elena. With no assistance allowed, the mechanical skills of the competitors were tested. In Tacna, if I had a hammer. Sergei Karyakin is the leader in the side-by-side. -side. And then goes the super clean, thanks to Kamas Master Team. They have everything needed. Close to the Chilean border, the competitors' physical strength and camaraderie shone through. Now we're going to fix the gearbox. You see, we've got a crack here. And uh, now we're going to use some glue. And uh, I hope we get it fixed for tomorrow. Repairs went on late. Mealtime, a chance to catch up with rivals and friends before a night spent in a bunk bed. As morning broke, Eleanor's mood was unimproved. Unhappy with the roadbook, he had to be persuaded to head back into the fray by Loeb. Uh, I've convinced Daniel to do another day. We're not going to walk to Arequipa after all. We'll get back there and then we'll see. He's not very motivated, he doesn't want to do it. We'll see. So a big day in prospect for the big shots. Stage five, seeing two separate sections of special, the first considerably longer than the second. The total number of kilometers to be covered, 451. A big effort then required from all before the rest day in Arequipa. To start with, life was a beach. Starting two by two, beginning with Nasser al Atia and Stefan Peter Hansel. Next to go, Jakub Prijonski and Nani Roma, podium rivals. Yazid Al Raji was quicker off the line than Love. The Saudi hit major difficulties, while the Frenchman settled into a fine groove. He successfully negotiated the dunes and finished the first portion of the special before the 66-kilometer neutralized section in first place, more than nine minutes clear of Al Atiyah. Carlos Sainz has only stage victories and supporting his mini teammates to play for now. The 2018 champion was even quicker than Love through the first waypoints before dropping down the field, finding trouble after 200 kilometers. Seventh overnight, multiple bikes champion Cyril Dupre lived up to that position throughout the first 314 kilometers. Peter Hansel was quicker than Al Atiyah initially, but later made a mistake, allowing the Qatari to pull out a couple more minutes ahead of the neutralization. Unfortunately, in the dunes, I made a mistake. I didn't see a big hole and we got stuck, so we lost several minutes, but we're not too far away from Nasser. To Al Atia, then the Toyota man holding off the Pacific Ocean of minis. Serene sailing for the twice champion with the proviso that he still had the last 137 kilometers to go. In his four wheel drive mini, Roma went into the neutralization, ranking third on the day, a place clear of Peter Hansel. Brzezonski was fifth, almost four minutes back from Roma. The day for the cars, though, 
was far from over. Sergei Kadiakin ran into a spot of trouble in the side by sides today. Leading by 11 minutes and 26 seconds overnight, the Russian was on course to lose his lead. He was over 23 minutes down at the halfway points of stage five.